Greetings, ladies from the WI here, because it's the 100th anniversary of the WI. And, of course, Calendar Girls was such a huge success, wasn't it, as a film and a stage play. <laughs> And Not June, much, we yeah. believe you were the only one who genuinely got your kit off. Yes. <laughs> I didn't. I wasn't like that. I. They'd have fallen off. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, I, I decided that uh, I wasn't going to be wrapped in a woolen blanket, and so I said, I'm going to knit in it. I'm going to sit at the WI meetings, I'm going to knit blanket squares. So I did, and I had two, one on each needle, <laughs> and I had a big, a big uh, knitting bag, the one Sophie had got from eBay, a big red velvet one, in the crotch. <laughs> And a pair of shoes. Yes. And I had my sandals on. So, anyway, one... Do you want to hear this? Yes! Yeah. Well, one day, Anita, cos you had a curtain. What was it like? Was it a blanket or a curtain? A sort of little curtain, And yeah, you like she used to hold round you Just while you got rid of your dressing gown and got in your pose. And one day, the knitting needle, the end of this knitting needle, got caught in it. Oh. And as she moved it, <laughs> so the knitting needle was <laughs> thinning, <laughs> like this, you see. <laughs> And I thought, any minute it's going to snap, and what am I going to do then? We were all laughing, weren't we? We were hysterical they were about it. But it was a disaster waiting and to happen. It didn't. It was all right. It came back. It was a bit bent. Oh, <laughs>